What's up YouTube? Welcome to the Brown Family Vlog. Today we're at Target trying to find things that we can blow up with baking soda and vinegar. Jubal, are you excited about it? Yeah! Alright, let's see what we can find. What else do you want to look at while we're here? <laughs> oh, you found a fart gun. <laughs> Ew. What let's else? keep looking. What we need to go and find is some small containers so that we can put baking soda and vinegar in them and then the pot, the tops will shoot off of them. So do you think okay. we can find that kind of thing? So what we used to use to do the baking soda vinegar things is film canisters, but I don't know if you've noticed, I can't buy film canisters anywhere. Let's see what we can find. Maybe we'll find some Tupperware. Or what kind of canisters do you have an idea for? Um. To blow up. They gotta be really tight when they close. Water bottles? Well, we can look. Let's go see. Dude, check this out. <laughs> Angry microwave cleaner. Angry mama. You put stuff in it and then steam shoots out of her head. Oh, that is so funny. How about this? Oh, that's glass. There might be shrapnel. Let's see if we can find something that's smaller and plastic. Okay. Okay. Somebody who works here. Hey, 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 where's the plastic Tupperware? How you doing? Hey, we're making a vlog and we're trying to blow up something with like baking soda and vinegar. And I'm wondering if you guys have like film canisters or something maybe in the sewing section that would be small film at the top canisters. that could blow up. Um, film canisters definitely not because they don't do that kind of film anymore in the photo department. Okay. Now, what, whoa, what about this? Oh, do they twist on it? Sauce? Or they, they, uh, they got they got tops, so they squirt out. I don't know if that would work. These are a little too small probably for you. Uh, but it's up to you guys, you know, if that's the kind of thing you're doing. But this is really what I was thinking for these little guys here. That might work perfectly. Okay. I don't know if they twist on or stick out, no. That's a little too big probably, right? That's definitely too big. That's a lot of baking and soda, baking soda vinegar. So I'm thinking maybe like, you know, the smaller ones might be cool, but that's about it, man. Awesome, thank you. Yeah, no problem. might be in our vlog. Uh, yeah, hey, how you doing? <laughs> All right, so this is, this is Brown Family Vlog. If you want okay, to look cool. on YouTube, Jerry. Hey, I'm Andrew. How you doing? <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, I hope the science experiment works out awesome. awesome. All right, guys. Thank you. Have a good one. Let's go find Mommy and show her what we found. Yeah. I think I'm recording upside down. How did that happen? I, I don't think so. You don't think so? All right, so we think we found something that might work, and we're also going to head over to the one-hour photo and see if we can find some film canisters. It's like an extinct monster. Dude, look at these. Dude. It's a unicorn head. It's a head. That looks more like a llama. So one of the things that drives me nuts is when you go through the drive through at all of the different places, they end up giving you a chocolate milk like this, which is not what I want in the car. Give me a cup with just a lid and a straw. But just in case you forget to ask for that, here's my life hack. They have these seals on the top. Get your knife out. Poke it a couple different directions. Keys will work too. Keys will work too. That's probably true. And then take a regular straw and pop that thing in there. And I would even say if you've got the right multi-tool with you, shorten it up. And now it's a little less likely to spill all over the place. And you have a happy four-year-old. Happy all right, photo place. Photo place. Photo place is probably down this way a little bit. Photo place. Let's go. What do you think, Sarah? Are they going to have film canisters there? I think we should do a fireworks. We should do fireworks instead? Oh, you're taking the selfie stick? Yeah. Well, you are serious about vlogging now. Can I see, Sarah? Can I see? Well, let's Let Sarah have a turn. Where are we going? Place, right? Photo place. Yeah. And I will find a fountain. And oh, you will ask the fountain. Here it is. I'd like to show you the fountain. Alright, here we go. The Art Craft Photo Works. Let's go see what they've got. Old school film. Exciting. Do you ah. guys have film canisters? 
Is there a particular type you need? The kind that explode with baking soda and vinegar. <laughs> That's what I thought you were getting at. Yeah. <laughs> Um, sometimes we, uh, you know, they're used for art projects, sometimes they're for science projects, so. Okay. Um, do you need, how many do you need? Uh, three or four would be good. Alright, let me see what I got. There's actually three or four right there. Look at that. Yeah. Have you ever seen those before, Jubal? No. Here's an extra. Thank you. You're welcome. Is it okay if we have you in our vlog? Why not? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why did the cow cross the road? Why did the cow cross the road? Because it un, because it ran out of room to fart. <laughs> Ew. Hey, Seraphine. Knock, knock. Who's the... Interrupting cow. Interrupting no. cow. <laughs> we are doing baking soda and vinegar experiments. Do you think that just a little bit of vinegar or a lot of vinegar will make a bigger explosion, guys? Um, a lot. A lot. lot. So what happens is when baking soda mixes with vinegar, it makes a gas because it's an acid and a base. There's a chemical reaction. And when the gas is in there, it starts to fill up the canister. See, guys? It fills all the way up in here. And then the canister can't hold all the gas it makes, and it shoots up in the air. Okay? So let me show you what the reaction looks like. I'm gonna grab a bowl here. This will work. So we put a little bit of baking soda in here and a little bit of vinegar. Watch what happens. See, and it's making gas, but the gas is shooting up in the air right now because there's lots of room in this room for it to go into, right? Yeah. But when it's in the canister, there's not gonna be room for it to go up. It's gonna fill the canister and then it shoots the canister up. A little bit of vinegar and a little bit of baking soda to start, right? Yeah. Okay, so what we do, we're going to take the baking soda in the top. See ya? And that's going to go on top of here. You got your safety goggles on? Mm -hmm. Good. Safety is number three priority, right? Yes. Okay. And we're going to put this on here on the top, and then I'm going to flip it over, and you wait and see what happens. Stay back. Whoa! I got, it, I got it, I got it, I got it. That was fast. Right. <laughs> yeah, we'll wipe it out. That's okay. Was that cool though? Yeah. So it doesn't take very much baking soda and vinegar, does it? Yeah, Let's awesome. cut it in half on the next one. Go. Whoa! <laughs> That's okay. We keep trying. You got it closer that time. Whoa. Try to put it in your palm. So you can push right on it like that, okay? I got it! Get set. Go. <laughs> oh, so close. <clears throat> Mine didn't shoot off either. Maybe there wasn't enough in it. Well, I did get more. Huh? There it goes. There wasn't quite, quite enough in there. Go. Oh, I think I heard it. Oh, close. <laughs> Did Daddy's go? That was crazy. Oh. I've got my own protected. Look out! That one's not working. I'm scared to touch it. Is it? Touch it. Go on. Ah! <laughs> yeah, I did it. <laughs> cool. Found it. It needed a poke. I'm still all over my safety goggles. In my head. Alright, so was that worth a trip to Target? Yes. Yeah, it was pretty cool. 
So thanks for watching the Brown Family Vlog. I hope that you guys really enjoyed it as much as we did. It was really neat to be able to share something like this with my son. <laughs> Because we used to do this all the time as kids, and I remember going to the Strong Museum of Play and seeing him shoot up 30 feet in the air. I don't think we broke anything on the ceiling today. But it was just neat to have an opportunity to pass something down to my son and share something that I grew up learning. And I hope that it is a blessing to you to get to watch the vlogs and let us know what kind of things you've liked in the vlogs, what kind of things you haven't liked. Hit the like and subscribe button for us. And if you don't want to miss any of the videos, make sure right next to the, sus the subscribe button, there's a little bell. And if you hit that, you can use it to send emails to yourself. Every time we upload a video, it'll go right to your email so that you won't ever miss one. And I hope that you guys have a great week. We're praying for you and God bless you.